before watching the video, don't forget to subscribe to our channel by clicking the subscribe button below and clicking the bell icon to be notified whenever we publish a new video. Home Remedies presents Living in High Technology World Evidence Based Potential Dangers. Hi, friends, today is a very interesting subject, so stay tuned with me and I will show you how some students performed an experiment which sheds light on the potential dangers of Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi is convenient, but many have raised doubts concerning the safety of unseen forces that permeate everything around us. Since the introduction of Wi-Fi in 1997, researchers have performed dozens of studies to explore the subject. The results are clear and shocking. Wi-Fi can negatively affect overall health and brain health, especially in children. Living in a high technology world, are we fully aware of the consequences of the daily use of our gadgets on our health? According to the Natural Cancer Institute, the three main reasons why people are worried about the negative effects of computers and cell phones is their potential to lead to various health issues, including several types of cancer, as cell phones emit radio frequency energy radio waves, a form of non-ionizing radiation from their antennas, tissues nearest to the antenna can absorb this energy. The number of cell phone users has increased rapidly. As of December 2014, there were more than 327.5 million cell phone subscribers in the United States. According to the Cellular Telecommunications and Internet Association, this is a nearly threefold increase from the 110 million users in 2000. Globally, the number of subscriptions is estimated by the International Telecommunications Union to be 5 billion. Over time, the number of cell phone calls per day, the length of each call, and the amount of time people use cell phones have increased. Researchers in England, Holland and Sweden reviewed the results of an experiment conducted by five high school students. These girls claimed that they struggled to concentrate and focus when at school. One of them, Lee Nielsen, says, We all think we have experienced difficulty concentrating in school if we had slept with the phone next to our head and sometimes also experienced having difficulty sleeping. They tried to see if the cause of the issues was Wi-Fi by placing 400 cress seeds separated in 12 different containers. In the same room, at the same temperature, with the same amount of water, they placed 6 of the containers next to a Wi-Fi router emitting the same type of radiation as a regular cell phone. After 12 days, while the cress seeds that were kept far away grew and became green, the ones next to the router were mutated or dead. As shown in the screen, you can clearly see the seeds far away from the router and the seeds next to the router. Lee says, it is truly frightening that there is so much effect, so we were very shocked by the result. She adds. None of us sleep with the mobile next to the bed anymore. Either the phone is put far away or it is put in another room and the computer is always off. Oli Johansson, a renowned professor at the Karolinska Institute in Stockholm, considers this experiment brilliant and is determined to repeat it with his tea in order to study the conclusions even further. The girls stayed within the scope of their knowledge, skillfully implemented, and developed a very elegant experiment. The wealth of detail and accuracy is exemplary. Choosing Cress was very intelligent, and I could go on. I sincerely hope that they spend their future professional life in researching because I definitely think they have a natural aptitude for it. Personally, I would love to see these people in my team. If you find this video useful, hit that like button to give it more value and don't forget to share on your social networks so that other people can benefit from it too. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.